so you keep on sewing and sewing till you get what you want i think i've gotten what i want and this is it you can still rearrange it so this is it this is it now i was able to make this one too from the extra i told us about but i just brought it to the side for us to see now there was no any accurate measurement on this one because um, it was an extra i told us of so you just do whatever you want to be if you have any extra so you have just have to tie this one So guys, I'm done, and this is how it came out. Now the next thing, I was able to stack this one to the side. So what we do next, or what I'm doing next, you can just use yours like this, and attach a flower or trimming to it, whichever way you want. You just be creative about it. Now these are trimmings. If you have your rose, you can attach to it. But I will be stacking this one to this side. This is it. Then. I will use my trimmings and just cover this patch up to get what I want. So I will just tack this one on this side. Okay, so I am done stacking it as you can see. And this is it. So the next thing for you to do is Either you use your glue gun to apply your rose like this. Either you use your glue gun to apply your rose or you use your trimming. So I'll be using trimming. There is no light. So we'll be using our our candle gum for it. Now this is it. You just lift it to get what you want. The next thing you'll do. You apply it here gradually and make sure when you are applying it you will do what you need to do immediately because the gum tends to dry very very quickly so this is it so I will apply it now and we are done so you can use your leaf design quinoline for your headband for turban now this is your turban all you need to do is just thread it you thread it before using the glue gun for your turban because if you don't thread it to your turban before using it you will not be able to sew sew the crinoline to the turban so you sew the crinoline to the turban first before applying your glue gun your trimming or your rose and you do you can use it for your um your fascinator too you can use it for your fascinator too the same thing you thread it first before putting your rose or your trimming and you can also use it for use it on your headband thank you very much and i hope you found this video very useful see you in my next class bye